All right, so I'm in a little vlogging mood, so I figured we'd start off this vlog here. I just went grocery shopping. I'm having a major like self, what's the word I'm looking for? I worked out, went to the chiropractor, went to the doctor, took Snoopy on a long walk, went to the grocery store, about to get drinks with my friend later. So I'm having just a, taking a kind of a day off today. Let's do a little grocery haul so I can put all this stuff away. I'm like squatted right now, but we're gonna do this fairly quickly because I gotta get out of here and like, a half hour uh, and I have to eat lunch what time is it? it's 2 45 oh he's waking up he's like mostly deaf and he's I would say probably like 70% blind he can see my face and he can see shapes and stuff so he doesn't know I'm actually here until he like sees a shadow or something so cute. okay so for the last I want to say probably three weeks I've been eating so much healthier overall than I usually do and I've also been doing Jillian Michaels 30 day shred for the last how long has it been? Probably like a week and a half now, maybe two weeks. I can see a difference already. Whenever I'm trying to like just get toned and stuff, I always do Julian Michaels 30 Day Shred. I swear by it, it works so good. And it's intense and it's only like 25 minutes long. And I usually just cut back on the carbs and like bread and stuff. And that's when I see the biggest difference in my body. So that's usually what I do. And then I just eat a shit ton more vegetables and like actual healthy things. So that's what I've been doing. So first thing I got is ground turkey because I want to make some turkey meatballs. And I ordered a spiralizer. I want to try doing like the zucchini noodles and put the turkey meatballs with that. Got some all natural crunchy peanut butter. This one was on sale for like half price. So I figured I would try it. We got some wine, not healthy. I got two things of light chicken of the sea. I think I'm gonna make this for lunch right now. I got little rice cakes. I have some chopped green onions already. By the way, I have like 5 million water bottles that need to be filled up back there. Probably mix this with some like light mayo. I also got Greek yogurt, which I might try mixing in instead of using the light mayo. And then put in some green onions and then put it on these rice cakes. So here's the Greek yogurt. I just got a giant thing because you can use this for tons of stuff. I got some pepperoncinis. I love some pepperoncinis. Frozen strawberries just for smoothies. I've been making protein smoothies after I work out. I have like a whey-free one that I use. I think it's a pea-based protein because if you have migraines, whey usually does not help the situation. So I just mix in some strawberries, like half a banana, spinach, and then the protein powder stuff. I was watching Alexandra Garza Alexandra Garza. Did you have a good nap? So Snoopy. Oh, you are so cute. You are so cute. Look at that guy. What a guy you are. So Snoopy, I'm fostering right now. He's available for adoption at Seattle Humane. Hopefully by the time this vlog goes up, he'll be adopted. Because you need a home. You cute. Oh, God. <laughs> um, where was I? Okay, so I'm making lower calorie pizza. I think about getting cauliflower crust, but I didn't feel like going to Trader Joe's and the one they had at Safeway was like 10 bucks, which is kind of ridiculous. So I ended up just getting this roasted garlic tomato sauce that I'm going to use as the sauce. This doesn't have any like added sugar or anything. It's literally just tomato, garlic, olive oil. Some spinach, which I'll probably put on the pizza too, but also just for smoothies. For the pizza, I got this part skim mozzarella that I'm just gonna chop up and put on the pizza. I wanted to do like a low carb pita kind of pizza, but I couldn't really find one that was low carb, so I just got one that they had. I got this idea from Alexandra Garza. Hi. I was watching a bunch of her vlogs the other day. I'm like hooked right now. Turkey, pepperoni, and then these pita pockets, only 100 calories, so they're looking at calories pretty good, but I'm just gonna warm these up in the oven with like the other stuff and bake it and make some semi-healthier pizza than like normal pizza. Chipotle cheddar salad kit just as like a quick lunch kind of thing. Some more ground turkey. This one's actually already seasoned for tacos, so I'm gonna make taco bowl bowls. Some egg whites for the turkey meatballs and then also just to have. Literally just drop the entire thing of tomato sauce. Minced onions and garlic powder and tapatio. I need to shave my armpits. Beyond me, I've heard good things about these patties just for like quick lunches and stuff. I've never tried this. It's a coconut curry vegan power bowl. These are breaded, so like not the best, but they're actually pretty low calorie. They have 170 calories, but these are so good. If you've never had these, the Morning Star, they're like the veggie patties, but they're buffalo chicken. These are so good. Some no fat beans for the burrito bowl kind of things. So sodium chicken broth because this little guy has trouble drinking water and chicken broth has been helping a lot. I just put like a tiny splash of chicken broth in his water and he'll drink it. I've never tried these, but these are wasabi crunchy chickpeas. So I'm gonna do it for like a quick snack. Some grapes, wash those. Four avocados, there's a couple more in there and then just some quick already cooked brown rice. I think you just microwave these. Bananas, cucumber. These I thought looked good as just like a bite. I don't need 
a whole lot of sweets at night. I just need like one bite of chocolate and I'm totally satisfied. So this is dark chocolate covered bananas. Also a good just sweet tooth kind of thing. These are the Jello chocolate vanilla swirls. They're sugar-free, they only have 60 calories in them. Some Pete's cake cups, dark roast, the other avocados. Also got some white corn for the bowls. But that was everything that I got. I gotta get going, make some food. So we'll see you guys later. Oh, look at that face. Autofocus, what is this camera doing? Just wanna see your pretty face. There you go. Look at those eyes. He's so sweet. I just filmed a video. I think it'll be up after this vlog is gonna be up, so I don't wanna tell you guys what it is, but it's a good one, or I think so. I've never seen it done before. You are the cutest little guy. <laughs> yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Whoa. That was a big one. So I just filmed, I think I'm gonna make the Mexican bowl things for lunch and I'm kinda gonna, gonna kinda get all that stuff and I'm gonna put them in containers so I can have lunch for like the next couple days with that too. So I'm gonna make like the ground turkey and the bowls and everything. I have two videos I need to edit today. I'm gonna schedule Friday's video, today is Thursday. Take him on a long walk. I think Rage is coming over to make dinner. I wanna make those pizza things that I was talking about, so. I'll probably show you guys that too. I'm in a weird cooking mood right now. I'm also gonna do Jillian Michaels. He gets so weird sometimes and just like stares at stuff. Like he'll be in the corner of a room just staring at the wall for a long time. Poor guy. He's pretty good about getting around though. He can definitely see shapes and stuff. So he knows like what to avoid. Sometimes he'll run into the mirror. Hey boo boos, he can definitely see my face. He's also mostly deaf. I don't remember if I said that. All right, so Mexican bowls are done. This is what I'm eating right now. Plate doesn't look the prettiest, but it's so good. I just put the taco mix, corn, fat-free refried beans with a little bit of cheese, half an avocado, some turkey with all the seasoning on it, and then these are the three that I'll have for lunches or whatever. I have a few more avocados, so when I go to heat them up, I'll obviously just put the avocado on. This is my favorite hot sauce, so freaking good. Jalapeno, and then also have tapatio here. So it worked out to Jillian Michaels level two today, stepping it up. Took him on a walk, Rach is coming over, I'm getting the pizza stuff ready, and then we'll probably go on like a longer walk with him when he gets hyper in a little bit. Got my wine going. This is the, I can't remember if I should, yeah, I think I showed you guys all this. But I'm gonna be making the little pita pizzas. This is the final pita pizza. Oh, you're all blurry. There's Rach's. They look good, they're nice and like crispy on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Is he the cutest or what? You just follow me everywhere, huh? He's a good boy. So I have some really attractive buns in right now because I just did a hair mask. What did I use? Here's a little peek under here. I used the L'Oreal Total Repair Mask. This is one of my favorite hair masks. Do you like this one? Is that your favorite too? I'm almost out of this one, but this I feel like actually does something. And I like to put it on my dry hair. One, because of the tape and extensions, but also I feel like I just, it does more if I leave it on for like an hour on dry hair and then I'll just rinse it out. My hair's like super soft, but with the extensions, I just section it off. So I don't put it like right up to the tape, but then at the top on my real hair, I'll bring it all the way up. So all my hair mask is on. I wanna try the Drunk Elephant TLC Baby Facial. I've heard really good things about this. It's like a 20 minute AHA mask basically. It's like a resurfacing, I guess you could call it a face mask, but basically like a resurfacing treatment. Why is this camera having so many issues focusing lately? And at the same time of this, I'm just playing back my footage. I always watch the entire video through before I export it just to make sure that everything's good to go. So I'm just playing it back. This one's like a half hour long. It's 35 minute long shadow and schmooze. So I'm like trying to get other stuff done while I'm doing this. Just washed it off and I wanted to show you guys out here in natural light. And my skin does feel very smooth, especially like my forehead. I feel like it looks really nice and smooth right now. You're not supposed to use it more than like once or twice a week, I'm pretty sure. So I'll keep using it and let you guys know, but right now it looks really nice.
three hours? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was already two and a half hours. Okay, so we're gonna be there in a couple hours. It's super early right now. Probably can't hear me because of the wind. in the Bouchard Gardens and our bus almost broke down. <laughs> it did kind of break down on the way up here. It takes like 40 minutes to get from where they drop us off to up here and it's, I think it's a free bus, right? It's included in the tickets or whatever. So now we're walking around the gardens, getting chill here for a little bit and then we're gonna head back down to try out some donuts <laughs> and food. It is the next morning. I just made some breakfast. I already edited this vlog that you guys are seeing right now. Just whipped up some eggs. We've got red pepper, green onion, regular onion, avocado. I'm gonna pop some tapatio on there. Got my coffee. Fish and chips yesterday were definitely not in the plan, but whatever, it was a cheat day. When I'm traveling, I definitely don't eat healthy because I feel like that's part of traveling is good food. My friend wants me to read this book. Let me know if you guys have read this. Only read like 30 pages so far, but we'll see. Let me know if any of you guys have read this down below. Look at that tush. You showing off your butt? Have you been doing a Brazilian booty workout? Don't mind my really thriving plant. Hi. <laughs> cuties. Hi cuties. You crazy. Oops. So today is Sunday. I'm pretty sure. Ooh, pretty sure I'm just going to <laughs> work out, finish editing this video, hopefully edit a second video, and then I need to run to PetSmart to get some more of his food. I need to return a couple things, so I think I'm gonna go run those errands. I might be going to like a flea market thing in Magnuson Park. I want to say thank you to Victoria Clipper for sending us out to Victoria yesterday. It was such a fun, quick trip. I wish we had like a few more hours there because by the time we got there and made it up to the gardens and stuff, we really only had like a few hours. So it's super cool that in a day trip, you can literally take a boat up to Canada. I would totally do it again for a day trip, especially now since we've already done the gardens. I think I want to go back and just do like a day of, what's going off my throat? A day of like downtown and exploring and stuff and eating. A bunch of you guys on Instagram recommended I think it was called Emperor's Donuts or something like that, the Emperor's Donuts. So we were trying to go there, but we totally ran out of time. So when I go back, we'll for sure go there. And the Clipper also goes to San Juan Island. So I think I'm gonna do that too, go to San Juan. I would way rather take like trains and boats to get around. It just makes it more fun and it's quick and easy. He's like ice skating on this whip floor right now. Rach watched Snoopy by the way yesterday. I didn't just leave him here. He had a good babysitter. He had a fun day. I actually missed him so much. I wish you guys could see his back legs right now. They're like fully straight. Anything I mention in vlogs is always linked down below. I try and link everything I'm like wearing, things I talk about, so everything's down below. But if you guys enjoy vlogs and you want them to continue, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Pretty sure I'm gonna have one coming really soon again because I'm gonna be vlogging the LA meetup and everything and that whole weekend. So there will be an LA vlog coming. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye. Can you give your uh, elevator pitch, please, sir? What do people need to know about you?